chair assembly delayed by more guests looking for Cheerios. Okay, Soko, I'm loving my chair. Well, at least the assembled one at the boat show. But there's this like random pile of hardware and the directions, not super complete. And they keep asking you to refer back to a picture, which they apparently forgot to include. So I'm feeling a little bit guilty here. Uh, we're at the boat show looking for things that we need. And I get one of these really cool chairs that can hang off the crane and think, isn't this great? So here's <laughs> the first problem I've run into. This hardware is crap. As you can see with this one, I don't know if you can get in closely enough on that to see it. It's to see that it's already rusting. It's rusting right out of the box. Oh gosh. So this is not going to work on uh, a marine environment. We're going to get stainless. And we have, if you look right there, it's countersunk. Head doesn't fit. So... I'm going to get stainless with round bolts and uh, if the round heads or the pan heads don't uh, fit in that, then I am going to countersink it a little bit more. But I'm walk through the hardware See, store. this is not what I was hoping for. I was kind of hoping for it would come assembled in the box. We would open the box and hang it up. Yay! But you know, when, when you buy a cheap chair... Oh, the... stop it. It wasn't cheap, baby. There's only... Dudes, when you sell an impulse chair to a woman at a boat show, it cannot be a huge problem for the captain. I would say this rusty hook and hardware that doesn't fit is a big problem for the captain, which makes it a big problem for the admiral buying impulse items at the boat show. So my cap is back from the hardware store more than $20 later, we now have hardware that will not rust the minute I start using my chair. So these rude little beasts come to the boat multiple times a day demanding to be fed. I can't imagine why. <laughs> working much better now that we have hardware that actually fits the chair. Time to tighten it up. And stainless hardware. Yes, it also needed to be stainless hardware to survive in a salt environment. Now they're angry at me. There were two curios sitting on the floor there. I kicked them both in. One duck got the two of them. They were also yelling at me. Now. Yeah, I think we've gone through three boxes of Cheerios this week. So far. sounded like a construction site the whole week because that house on the hill we've been working on non-stop that is going to be quite the behemoth you would think in the era of YouTube vendors would be much more careful because everybody is an amateur film crew slash critic. So you get to here where you still have all these metal hooks that you had to do something with, but you'll notice the directions stop there, which is right where we are.
favorite knot over there. What? Got a half hitch going. Two half hitches. Two half hitches. That's my all-purpose Bodhi knot. So now he's going to send the crane hook down and we will hook the chair to it and see if I land in the water or rest comfortably. I'm hoping for rest comfortably. That would be best. Next step after tightening is to crank it up and over the edge, make the final adjustments, and then relax with a good book. So here we are, it's done. It took a little bit more work than I expected to assemble it, but it is quite comfortable and I'm overall I'm glad I purchased it.